Where are they going there? I'm selling my boat. I'll show you around it. It's got a 345 Nuffield engine on it. It's an old tractor engine. It's a three cylinder. And as you can hear with the sound of it, it runs beautifully. This thing just go and go and go. So we uh, got this lid on the engine and it, uh, it quiets it down a bit, but it's still bloody noisy. Got a couple of couple of deckhands today, giving a uh, bit of a scrub all the shit. What do you say? Young people, you know, good fun. There's a windlass up the front there, and that bag there is full of anchor chain, heaps of it. Down here is where you get the decompression, turn the engine off, and it's a piece of plywood that goes across there. You can make it one big double bed, or you can have two berths. This is the old wiring, and it's all fucked. It needs to be replaced. It's the only thing that's working is the uh, generator. Or at least the alternator. You've got your starter motor battery there. You've got one spare bilge pump battery there that goes to a separate bilge pump. There's your house battery and that goes to another bilge pump. That's that bilge pump down there. When your engine's running, you can either charge your engine battery or your house battery. Right now I'm charging the house battery. Most of this other shit just doesn't really work. This works, but it's not wired up, so right now it doesn't work either. My daughter's uh, pretending she's a pirate, but she's not really a pirate at all, she's just being silly. She's pretending that she's just caught a fish now. We can cook up a feed here, because under here there's a bit of a, uh, a sink with a wee cooker. And on the other side you've got the uh, kit that's caught us over here. There's our wheel. I had her out of the water a while ago and I gave her a bit of a clean. She needs some anti-fouling. To be honest, she needs some paint too. And that's why I want to get rid of it because I can't be stuffed with mucking around with all the time. This here keeps the rain out but doesn't keep the bird shit, gets covered in bird shit out here. This little dinghy, which is a piece of shit, actually comes with it. So that's a good deal, isn't it? Spencer's cleaning all the bird shit off it and there's plenty of it. It's not so little jobs like this, it's fucked. Look, it's all rotten and needs replacing. That there's buggered. Now that's the sort of job that's superficial. Doesn't take much to do but it needs to be done. I can't be buggered doing it. Do you want to do it, mate? Nah. Hannah's giving her a bit of a scrub too. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's doing a good job. We've got the solar panel here. This actually looks after the uh, bilge pump. My mooring is 20 bucks a week. But if you buy the boat, I'll give it to you for six months free. And after that you have to pay for it. So $5,000 firm, not negotiable. It's a good price, what you get really. It takes in a little bit of water. The pump goes, this bilge pump goes about every hour and it's maybe a litre. So yeah, like all old wooden boats, but that's why they're cheap and that's why I'm selling because I'm sick of wooden boats. I don't want to sell it to anybody that's never had a wooden boat. You need to know all about wooden boats. My daughter says she wants to be a boat bitch, but she's not going with a boat. You're not. No. Uh, guaranteed with the boys that you can be my friend. Oh, wow. Come that's on. Pretty good. Like, you're going to clean I'm the boat, really though? Really you're going to clean the boat? I'll come hang out on the boat. You come hang out on the boat. <laughs> hey, if you're dead serious, uh, give us a call. Uh, if you're not real serious, don't waste my time because I've had a few time wasters and. Uh, it's only 5,000 bucks. You can't do it, but you can steam to Derval on this. It'll take you six, seven hours. We can go to Able Tasman National Park, pick the right weather. You need to take it out and put some anti fouling on it. It needs a bit of paint. Other than that, it's a good boat. So if you want to buy it, let me know. See you later. Be good. You can't be good, be careful. Where are we going? Well, you need to actually have the boat up so you can see where you're going. <laughs> Lift the front of the boat up. You can't go. With like that, like, there you go. Oh, you over here, mate. Now you're going the wrong way. Over this way. Over here. Come on. Fuck. You're right. I'm great. Okay. Spencer couldn't even do this. Yeah, Spencer. What's the story, man? Well, you made the lady do all the work. Back and forward, and uh, she volunteered, so I gave her a turn. Oh, right. Yeah. Anyway, because you got that mullet, you get away with doing nothing, man. Well done, Hunter. <laughs> Too easy, mate. Too easy. Is that my stone? What you got? It's not that exciting. I thought it was cooler when I picked it up. It's always like with stones. They're wet and exciting and then later on when they dry out they're just shit. People like that too.